hello family welcome back to the channel so today i have for you the simple low carb zucchini or courgette noodles with some shrimps it is really good and very easy let's get started so to start off i am going to be seasoning my shrimp you can use any seasoning of your choice but i am going to be using some garlic granules some all-purpose seasoning salt black pepper onion um, granules and some paprika powder like I said you can use any seasoning of your choice and I will be listing everything in the description box below so please do check that out for everything that I am using I'm going to be leaving the pepper flakes out or the chili flakes out and I'll use this later on in the dish So I'm just going to mix everything together ensuring that the seasoning is all fully incorporated and then I'm going to leave this aside to marinate just for a little while while I get on with my zucchini. So here are the ingredients that I will be using, very very simple and quick so I've got my zucchinis or courgette if you live in England and I've got some onions, some lemon, butter, olive oil and some other seasonings. Now I am going to be using a spiralizer, I got this very long time ago but I'll try and find you a link and put it in the description box below. I'm just going to show you the different sort of shapes that you can do so you can have it this way like very very thick i did this but i'm going to use it later on for a different um, recipe but if you want it this thick you can have this thick or if you want it looking like this like a proper spaghetti or noodles you can also have it this way okay So now that I am done, it looks like a proper spaghetti, if I may say so, okay? I'm just going to be removing the middle bit out. It's a bit watery and I'll just leave that out because it's not very tasty, okay? Now, to start with, I'm just going to be placing some unsalted butter into my hot skillet and then I am going to be adding in my shrimps or prawns. You can also use chicken or any other meat of your choice for this recipe. It will work equally very, very well. So I'm not going to be cooking this for a very long time because as you know, if you overcook shrimps or prawns, it's going to have that rubbery texture. So you literally just want it to turn pink and then you can just have it out of your skillet okay you don't want it to overcook it at all so cook one side for like less than a minute and then cook the other side as well and then you're just good to go And just to let you know that I am doing this on low to medium heat, you don't want to cook it on a very high heat, okay? Like I said, you don't want to overcook your shrimps. So now that it is lovely and pink, I'm just going to remove this from my hot skillet and then get on with making the noodles. You can just use normal noodles, normal carbs noodles for this. It is going to taste even better, okay? But for the ones that want to have a low carb diet or just be more health conscious, this is the best way, okay? So I've just added in a little bit of olive oil into the hot skillet and I'm adding in some onions and some garlic as well. And I'll be frying this for maybe about a minute or so until it's nice and translucent. Just give it a quick stir and just leave it to cook for about a minute.
so after a minute i am just adding in my chicken stock you can add any other stock of your choice but i really really like the taste of this chicken stock and i'm adding in some fresh parsley you can use dried parsley if you don't have any fresh parsley and then some crushed chili for a little bit of heat you can omit this if you don't like the heat you can add more you can add less it is entirely up to you you can add more vegetables to this if you want but i just like to keep this very very simple So some people add um, wine to this at this stage but I'm not a really big fan of cooking with wine um, however I am adding in some lemon it's going to give it a nice zesty tangy flavor it is really really nice and it will go well with the seafood as well just give everything a quick mix and allow this to cook for about a minute or two So I will now add in my zucchini into my pan and really and truly that is it. This meal is so so simple and very easy and very delicious and very good for you as well okay. There is barely any carb in this meal and it's the perfect meal if you want to enjoy low carbs meal every now and then okay or if you're on a keto diet this meal is the perfect meal for you or just simply trying to avoid a little bit of carbs you know every now and then okay i hope that you enjoyed watching this video and i hope that you are inspired to try this meal out okay and if you do don't forget to tag me in your pictures on Instagram or Facebook and I would love to see all your creations of this meal, okay? Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel and also comment below and let me know what you think about this low carb meal. Give this video a thumbs up by liking the video for me, okay? Also, don't forget to share this video with all your loved ones. It could help somebody who's trying to, you know, get some inspiration into their low carb diet. Okay. Thank you so, so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Take care of yourself. Bye.